Listen, I don't know if y'all met Dorsey or not yet. She just keeps cutting off my step. Okay, I'll introduce y'all. Mrs. Dorsey. She's country as can be. I'm talking about she 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 fights lacy round heads and Kelso Cross in the short knife. That's how country she is. I'm talking about country like drinking buttermilk with your dinner. Mm, that's country. Mm-hmm. Let that sand get twinks your toes. You ain't country unless you've been on that creek bank with that sand get twinks your toes. No need for a fancy intro. Y'all know who we are and what we do. Look at what? CJ already found something. Uh oh. Look like a dead possum right there. Look like Miracle or Bruce or somebody been putting in a little work. Dead possum, dead possum. Hey boy, what you told? What is that? Look like we about to get after it. Look like we about to get after it. Come on y'all. Like I was saying, no need for no fancy introduction. No need for no script. No need for no role playing. When that camera come out and we find us something to get into, this game here that y'all see, they plumb get after it. Ain't nobody else like them. Mama sick today. So today we just gonna hang out. I'm gonna take the kids fishing, keep them out of the house a little bit. And we just gonna sit around and be grateful for another day. Let me open this gate and let y'all in. Like I say today, y'all, it's been kind of a up and down day. I'm always upset when Hannah's sick, but hey. Next man up. Next man up. Whatever it takes. If I got to cook, that's what I do. And when I say I, I mean these three right here. That's right. They cook, clean. What? What you want to say? You ain't never seen a dead animal. No. Well, you see one now. He gone like yesterday. He gone like yesterday. Stay yeah. tuned. Daddy. The good news about me having the kids by myself today is Hannah can't edit me out. We finna cut a food. <laughs> so get ready. <laughs> and I hope y'all got y'all good shoes on. Um, I don't have Because the rule is every time you miss a fish, you got to run a suicide. That's right. Every time you miss a fish, got to run suicide. Deal? Ah, uh, no right. deal. Mainly, y'all, we just want to try to keep uh, these kind of videos going for the kids' sake. They like to watch them and laugh at them in the living room. And we've uh, picked up two or three, you know, uh, two or three additional people that kind of like our channel. So we got to keep videos. We got to keep content. That's another thing, guys. If you guys want to continue to see us make these videos, we need you guys to share the videos. Don't just take them and watch them. Hit the like, the thumbs up on there for us. Share it to your social media. Share it to your TikTok. Share it to your Facebook. Reese, Miles, put me on your Tiki Talk. <sighs> but share our stuff, guys, because the more hits we get on some of our videos, the more it prompts us to continue to make them. You know? If we're putting all this time and two and three and four hours into editing a video and it's only got five or six views, Maria ain't gonna keep doing that, y'all. She ain't gonna keep doing it. She, ain't, she gained, but she'll quit. She ain't gonna keep doing it. Mm. So make sure y'all at least share the videos. Uh, quick birthday shout out. I'm rambling on, but I'm trying to catch up everything before we get to fishing. Quick birthday shout out. Uh, y'all look at that bug. That bug look like a peacock. Birthday shout out. I missed the birthday shout out. May the 7th. May the 7th, Glenn Family Farms. Happy birthday to you from our family. We wish your family the best. We'll catch up soon. It's just been rough. We'll catch up soon. Uh, and I got a, just found out a neighbor from, that I met four years ago. Introduced myself to him four years ago. and uh, Introduced myself to him four years. He pulled in my driveway this morning. And uh, said he wanted to shake my hand and give me a hug. He took my cards off with him. He's also somebody that kind of watches our channel. And he's moving off. I think he told me to massachusetts he's gone but uh he said he'll continue to follow us there uh it's one of those things where it's one of those small moments where hannah and i kind of moping around the last two weeks you know everything's going all bad mother's day all our mothers are out of town 
So, you know, mopey holiday, you know. But it kind of reminds us to stay in tune with the good thing, the positive things, because it can always be worse. You know, that neighbor thought enough of my family to want to stop in and tell us goodbye, tell us he's going to be following our channel. And that right there, you know, bought me up, you know, spiritually enough where I can kind of get out of the house and bring y'all another video. But again, thank y'all for watching. We ain't going to get too soppy, but we going to catch some fish. And these boys right here, y'all ready to cut loose? Yeah. Yeah. We going to cut loose. Ain't no telling. We might take the boat out to the pond. We might swim through it. We don't know. We might tear up the garden. We might spray it with Roundup. You just never know what you're going to get. When you cross that creek, you never know what you're going to get. So listen, y'all stay tuned. Stay with us. We're going to turn this thing back on once I get this stuff all, uh, all uh, set up. But before I go, I wanted to remind y'all, you can always tell it. It'll be real obvious if somebody's getting after it. If they ain't getting after it, it'll be obvious. They got to be sweating. They got to be working. So stay tuned. Check with y'all here in a minute. Three subscribers. Yeah, you got three subscribers. Yeah. That means, listen, your three subscribers want to see you uh, catch some fish or something. Thank you for watching. All right. Looks like he's over here messing. I'm sorry. He's over here. Uh, he's doing bushcraft is what he's doing, Rachel. He's building a clay modular home bushcraft because he's heard that homes right now with the impact going on are selling for half a million. So what he's going to do is, I mean half a million. So what he's going to do is he's going to build him a clay home out of this. And he's going to sell this home for half a million. You going to sell it, boy? Yeah. All right. And when you sell it, what are you going to buy? A new home. You want to buy a new home? Yeah. He said he's going to buy him a new home. He better buy me one, too. But we're going to build this home. What are you building? What is that right there? How many subscribers you got? You got three? What do you want to tell him? Subscribe. Subscribe. Listen, what are you building? What is that? Look like a, what you making? Huh? This. What is it? A dump truck. Oh, you making a dump truck. You about to go sell that thing, ain't you? Yeah. He says he's making him a dump truck that he's getting ready to go sell on eBay because he's ready to buy me, you know, ladies Abu Garcia. Riding real. Actually, I ain't never been no A boot kind of. I just been on Zip Code 33 my whole life. Zip Code 33. Go get 30 chicks, they said. Go get 30 chicks. It'll be fun. They cutting off my every step and they mean business. I can tell that just by looking at them. They told me go get, look at them. I ain't got nowhere to step. We're going to go ahead and get these things out on the grass today, too. I don't really like them in here that much. We might go ahead and get around the chicken tractor. So we came in there to turn the lights off on. Hopefully they'll let us back out. We'll see. They beat me to the door. I got y'all. Ha ha. Oh, that right there said he won't be on YouTube. He said, put me on there too. Love that chicken from Popeyes. Anybody know me? No, I ain't driving past too many Popeyes. Got to have it. Got to have it. Got to have it. The dry biscuit and all. Got to have it. So. If any of you. If any of you. Ever been fishing country style. You know. We ain't going to no Walmart. I don't see no Walmart for ways. We ain't headed through no Walmart to buy no bait. Period. We going to the other bait store. Going to the other bait store. All right, guys. So it's bitten me in my butt. Looks like I did all that bragging about how we we're getting ready to catch us some worms and this, that, and the other. The kids and I, we've worked 20, 30 minutes endlessly trying to find us a worm, and we can't find not an earthworm to show. So I interrupted this video. We're going to continue looking, but I interrupted this video to go ahead and introduce what's coming to the farm next. Coming to across the creek 2.0 next, we're going to grow us a night crawler farm. I can't be looking for worms. Stay tuned. Give us any advice. Drop it in the comments on what we can do to start us old night crawler patch. Thanks for watching. So them chicks that want out of here so bad. What y'all say we let them come on right on out of here?
They won't act so bad. Yeah, they won't act so bad. Mama gonna throw a fit, ain't she? So listen. What kind of fit y'all think mama gonna throw? A good and stay tuned. She was down one day. Came out and let everything out. Let everything out. And he's gonna end up getting his head stuck. Get his head stuck. We got to go in there after him. And his head. And his horns gonna get stuck. Horns get stuck too. Yeah. So listen, y'all. We told you guys we were in a struggle for bait. Couldn't find any bait. So any of you that watch the channel much. Y'all know I'm a firm believer in dropping something to the bottom. Try to get that flathead. Yeah, I saw something. In the I can't find no worms. What you see? No oh, something. I can't find no worms. I mean, I can't catch no bluegills. Can't catch me no bluegills. I was going to catch me some bluegills. Hand size. Hand size bluegills. Can't catch them. Doing my chores with my chickens. I found a couple of dead chicks. Dead chicks. Dead chicks. Dead chicks. Man, it got too cold on them. We don't know. Obviously, y'all know it's time to slop them hogs. It's obviously what time it is. We're going to take one of these chicks and we're going to put them out in that jug line that y'all saw in the previous video. You probably say, Hannah's sick. So, who's going to chase down the jug line? It's going to be this one. <laughs> time to get after it. Time to get after it. So, we're going to throw one of these little chicks in. To our pigs, we're gonna let him munch him up, and we're gonna hook the other one on the hook and see if we can catch Moby Dick. Let's get this chick out of here. You the other chick on the hook. Yeah. On the hook, we're gonna put him on the hook. Those dead chicken. Let's see who want them. Let's see who want them. Let's see who want them. Oh, black girl got him. Black girl says she out of here. Well, my cross the creek family, you guys know, I always try to get y'all the exclusive. However, this pig's been a little difficult. It took the chick and it's gone with him. It's got him in a hundred different pieces. I know we got some young viewers that don't like to see blood and that kind of stuff, but we also got some older viewers that are like myself, a little immature, and we like to see that kind of chaos. Let's go see if, stay there, guy. Let's go here and see if we can get y'all some close up shots of it. Guys, we don't waste nothing. If you got sensitive eyes, don't look. We don't waste nothing. Oh, she's got beat. Look like piggy beat her out of it. Let's go over this thing. Let's see if we can get some exclusive content. Oh! Oh, I lost the shoe and like to fail. I lost them J and M. Young boys on the basketball team, quit wearing them Crocs. Let's get over here. Listen, listen. We deserve a like and subscribe for this. A like and subscribe. I'm in a pig pen. I'm trying to get you guys exclusive content. I know frog. Frog want to see the blood in the guts. I got to get in here and get the blood in the guts. They playing keep away. Alright guys. I don't have all day to tie my day up into that. We going to go hook the other one up. We're going to drop it on the jug line. We're going to drop it about, I don't know. We we'll suspend, I like to suspend them like Justin taught me. I like to suspend them two or three foot from the bottom. So we probably going to drop it about seven foot down. Main channel ledge. Anybody knows me know I like main channel ledge fishing. Main channel ledge. They ate the guts out of them. When you're ready, come get your turn. Can dry it out, dry it out, cured, salt cured, baby, salt cured, maple salt. Get popped by the fence, Chris. All right, guys, let's head on back. 
we're gonna drop this thing to the bottom see what we can catch today what y'all think y'all ready yeah, yeah. Oh, no, let's get after it Huh? Somebody did it to you? Yeah. Who did something to you? DJ. What he did? DJ, DJ what you do to him, boy? With the help of these three beautiful, smart, intelligent, ingenuitive, I was an inch intuitive, I don't know how to say it. Look what they've created. They got the chicken baited up. We got lug nuts. Now, we're straight from plum from the country. We believe in lug nuts. They use lug nuts for weight. They decide they want to use this as a sinker. Isn't that what you guys decided? Yeah. And that's going to keep it down in the water. And we got our jug. Somebody got to go get it here in a minute. So, Justin Johnson, if y'all watch, we're going juicy juice to a baby chick. And we finna get all good. Stay tuned. Let's get that thing pitched out there. Watch. Yeah, that's the point. That's what we want that bottle though. It's gonna be a good one. Girl, you got him. Where are you at? He got off. He got off. He got off the hook. Baby girl, your subscribers ain't gonna believe that. You sure you're telling the truth? Where is he at? He's gone. He come off. All right, let's put you another bait on there. You think maybe we got the wrong babies at the hospital? Yeah. Who you think these are for? Uh, clowns. Some clowns? Mm -hmm. I guess you heard that, Hannah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I don't know. They act a little weird. Like they playing ring around and rosy around each other. Yeah, that's definitely some clowns. Clowns. Circus. Circus. Like a circus. Hey, Columbos. Y'all all right? What y'all doing? <laughs> Never mind. Well, Skylar just missed the first fish. She's a little frustrated. She said brothers won't be still. Can't catch nothing, they won't be still running all the fish off. I guess I understand. We're gonna bait this thing back up and toss it back out. But before we do that, we've got to get inside and check on Hannah. She's in bed. We gotta make sure she's all right. And we'll come back out, have us a little snack and Continue turning in random circles, I guess. Like clowns. Like clowns. Stay tuned. All right, guys. I don't know if you guys can see some of those smaller fish we caught in our little trap here. We're going to walk y'all to the area. We've started keeping us a new, set us up a new tank set up. My brother Marquise, I'm sorry about you. Where I'm holding this camera at today, guys. I'm having to walk and talk. Here it is. We got it set up over here for our turtle bay. Right here, we've got limbs and stuff hanging up on me. And we might do something on this side here and the left side here. But uh, we're also going to put up some lights on this to some light up at night time. So when we're standing outside on the deck here, you'll be able to see down and the pool will be lit up. But this is where I'm housing some of these little, little guys. And I'm using them kind of breeder, bait fish, whatever. Because whatever fish I decide to put in here, Every fish I decide to put in here is going to eat it. Everything eats minnows and that sort of thing. So, uh, just wanted to show you all that. It's nowhere near done. Nowhere near final project. Come on, guys. Let's go check on Mom. Nowhere near done. We got a lot of stuff we're going to add to that. We're looking at frogs, turtles, I don't know, sucker fish, catfish. It's going to be my catch em all tank, Kafaro style, baby. Paul Kafaro. Catch em all tank. And it's going to be natural. So it may not look like much right now, but stay tuned. As I always say, you know I'm coming with a show. Thought you should know. You press, you thought you wasted on me. It's just me and Morgan out here today. Got my boys. We're going to throw down. Me and Morgan. Them prayers must have finally made their way on through, didn't they, babe? We're going to get baited up. We're going to throw another one out. We'll check back with y'all in a minute. Here I came, bro. Let's get baited up. Nick and Keith, tune in. Nick and Keith, tune in. 
I try to tell y'all, they look like Nick and Keith. That's how Nick and Keith used to be on that watermelon. They used to cut through it up there. Mm. I tried to tell y'all a long time ago. When somebody is getting after it, it's obvious. You'll be able to tell. This girl ain't ate it to the white rind. That's getting after it. There's eating watermelon, people. There's eating watermelon, and then there's getting after it. They look like Nick and Keese over there. Getting after it. All right, guys. You guys hadn't saw much fish, many fish being caught. Because honestly, since I've started this camera and we've been fishing, it's been nothing but a complete blooper reel. If you can imagine going fishing with three children, all under the age of five or six, they've been tangling up lines. They've just been having a good time. I do need to uh, take a second to update y'all on some videos you guys are going to see coming out. We've got our water aerator, water fountain. It's a big project, bigger project than I thought. But we've got that video it should come out soon. Uh, Hannah's been sick, so I'm going to sit down and do some editing myself. Let's come over here and let's see what fish we've got. What y'all say we use our net and get them out of there? Mm -hmm. yes. Thought you should know. Oh, prayers you thought you wasted on me. Who want to put the first wing in? Me. All right. Me. Finally me. make your way on through. <laughs> let's see. All right, baby girl, here you go. Looks like, oh, you're going to take them out of there. What's your name again? Looks like a crappie. Baby crappie. Mm -hmm. He's stuck in there. He's in there. He's in So, as we promised y'all, you're seeing that right. We're putting baby crappie and grin in here. Okay. We're going to let them things grow on out. And this right here is going to be probably more like a hobby tank for us. We're going to go with some colorful fish as well, but this is probably going to be more of a natural river set up. We're going to get us some bass in there. I figure y'all might want a close up of beyond. Inside our mouth. They move. Country style. Alright guys, long day. Look like our battery's running out of power. I ain't charged. It's been working all day. But I'm headed back down here. I'm watching my back there because I see a cow coming up on me. But I'm headed back down here. And I'm headed with some kibbles and bits. No, I ain't feeding no dog. I ain't feeding no dog. I already fed them. I already fed the dogs. I'm tired of getting skunked. Anybody who knows me knows what I'm about to do with this feed. I ain't caught nothing all day. I'm tired of getting skunked. I've been having rods and lures out. I, done, I threw everything in the tackle box at them. Caught nothing with no size on, just a bunch of dinks. I apologize in advance, y'all, about the camera movement. I'm walking and trying to navigate through all these gates and stuff. And we're gonna get out here, we're gonna throw some kibbles and bits out. We're gonna get out here though this old jug here. We're gonna bait it up. Can't catch no fish, let's just bait it up. What y'all say? This old trick Le Man showed me. Johnsonville, Alabama. Le Man. Le Man. Franklin County, Connecticut County. Can't think of the name of it. Show them that Le Man trick. We're gonna bait the water up. Get them turning around real good for us. Of course, the ducks ain't gonna let the fish eat by themselves. They got to come in. Let's see if we can get some fish coming in here. I don't necessarily care at this point if they bite it anymore. I just want them to come in. Let's see if we can get. How about that? Let's see if we can get something coming in here. Whoa, we got something flying in right there. Anyhow, I was trying to do my intro and they interrupted. Hey, next bird interrupts my intro, you're going to the auction. No doubt about it. Now, as I was saying, before he so rudely interrupted me, let me show y'all a white head. This is one of my favorite little hens. I'm going to brag about it. It's a white head right there. Beautiful white headed bird. 
So anytime y'all get on here and we got a video up that you guys is not necessarily that is not necessarily down you guys' lane, go ahead and skip to the next video. Won't make us upset. Skip to the next video. We've got I don't know, we got a few videos up, up at this point, and there's I'm sure there's something up, up there that any of y'all can get on there and laugh at. Sorry y'all, I stopped talking. That old jug done something. Look at that jug swimming. See that jug swimming off? Y'all see that jug swimming off? Guys, I think we got to go get us a jug. Stay tuned. I'm leaving the camera on. We got to go get that jug, baby. We got to go get that jug and see what's on there. Got to. Whoa, lost my shoe in the creek. So, y'all look, I'm so excited. I can't even get out there too. Lord knows I better not fall in. I can't swim. We got to go get this jug, guys. Listen. I ain't no professional at driving this boat. Any yous not to drive this boat any better than I do? We need somebody to come out here, come through that screen, and come land this fish for us. I was trying to end the video, guys. We're gonna get over here and see what we got on this rod. I mean, this old jug here. Look at that old jug taking off. Let's see if we can get it right here. Let's see. What That jug in my hand here. Oh, dink. Yeah. As you can see, we've got sunfish on there. We took the chicken off. The chicken just hardly didn't catch us nothing. But we've got a uh, sunfish on. And uh, this is sort of how jug fishing works. You've got your, your jug there as your cork. And it and it's weighted to a string here. And that's about how it works. It's been a patient journey. We've waited a long time for this small fish. Hannah says hello. What you got? Dink. Dink. Been a long day waiting on Dink. Let me get him off here. That thing's ugly. He ain't he ain't big, but he's mean. Listen, he try to take my lug nuts. He's gonna take them back down there and sell them on Amazon or something, probably. Probably pawn them. Come here. <laughs> he said, no, he ain't coming here neither. There you go. Well, there's the relief. I think that's it for today. We appreciate you guys watching. We're gonna get this video edited and up quickly. Thank y'all for coming along with us. <laughs>